Welcome back. In this video, I'll show you how to edit text with glyphs. So what's a glyph? Glyphs are extra characters that you can use in fonts. These characters allow you to use accent marks with letters, access other language characters, and even add more decorative letters to use in your fonts. First, select the text box that you want to edit by clicking it twice to put it into editing mode. I'm going to do that here. Okay, you will know that it's in editing mode when you see the cursor blinking. Edit the text so it says what you want and then add the glyph character. I'm going to leave it as it is saying to a magical celebration. And I am going to highlight the letter M. That's the one I'm going to change. And to do that, I need to go up here to the glyph panel button and click that. You'll see this drop down box here. And I'm going to scroll through. I can see that I have capital letters with accent marks, lowercase letters with accent marks, and then these decorative letters down here. I'm going to find the M. When I click it here, it replaces the old one that I had highlighted. I'm going to go to the word celebration and highlight the end letter. Click the glyph panel and scroll down until I find my decorative N with a little line coming off the right side. There we go. Perfect. So you can add a glyph anywhere in the text by placing the cursor in the position you want the glyph first and then select the glyph you like to use. So let's say I don't have a glyph. Um, there's no letter here at all. Let's say I wanted this word to be an instead of a. I could just type an N and highlight it or I could leave it like that. Click the glyph panel, scroll down to the end and it'll appear. So I'm going to delete that so it makes sense. Some sellers use fonts with extra glyphs to allow for more decorative text. You'll usually find these glyphs added to the first and last character of words or names in a template. You are able to change or remove the glyph that's already been added by the seller, or you can add one yourself if there isn't one at all. But keep in mind that not all fonts have glyphs available to use. You can only use extra glyphs if the font supports it. If you have any questions, you can watch help videos or reach out to support by going to help.template.com or by clicking the help link in the top right corner.